So last week I was in the Selfridges store checking out the Formula One stand where they were displaying Alfa Romeo's C42. And I was like, this car is really cool. And then an idea popped into my head. I'm sure you guys have seen these wall mounted Formula One cars or this vertically mounted Pagani. And we're like, that would be really cool, but I can't fit that in my apartment. But it's still really cool. So I have an idea and I'm going to test it out, see if it works. Okay, I found a 3D model of Ferrari's 2022 F1 car. And the idea is to just take everything apart except for this nose cone section and 3D print it and put it on a wall. But before I do that, I kind of want to test how it looks. So I have the 3D model here. And what I want to do is just keep that nose part. So I'm going to just select everything and press control on the nose. And these little, I think they're the camera pods. I'm not too sure. Um, some screw points here, but you can kind of see where that seam should be. Um, in this 3D model, the whole kind of top cover is modeled together. So I'm gonna need to actually cut that. But everything else here, I can just delete. So I'm just gonna quickly separate this. All right, so I split the meshes and I just kept everything that is on the front nose cone replacement piece. So now it's time to pop this into a render software and just see kind of how it looks. I also need to get all like the sponsor decals on here and I need to paint it and do all sorts of funky stuff. So, so by the looks of it, everything that isn't painted Ferrari red is just exposed carbon. So that's what we're going to use as a base layer here. That took a whole lot longer than expected. Um, I had to go back into the 3D software and split the mesh so that it would uh, allow for different colors on one part, um, which was pretty convoluted, but regardless, we're here anyways. Um, as you can see, we picked out the material. So we have like the carbon that is like shiny and then the slightly satin red. Um, right now it looks a little bit dark, but I think if I switch the lighting, it'll look more accurate, but this is the official like hex code for the Ferrari red, um, for 2022. So I hope that if I like change the environment, it'll look a little bit brighter. So I haven't been able to find like good reference photos for these like decals on the nose. So what I've done is I've opened up F1 2022 and I'm going to use this like car viewer as like a reference on where to put these stickers. So yeah, I'm going to take a couple photos and I'm just going to use them as reference. All right, so we're finished. After like four hours of playing around with the logos, we put everything into place. So we got all the logos where they should be. Um, now it's time to put this into a living room and see if it looks good. Okay, so this looks really good. So I need to figure out how to make this and how to put this on Etsy because I would love to sell this and see this on people's living rooms and desk setups. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys. This was a weird little test I wanted to do and I'm glad I did it because it looks great.